Okay, so this video is a video to hopefully help all of you guys out there that have the DJI Mavic Pro that are having connectivity issues. The, uh, it says the, um, the gimbal is not connected. All right, so, so I'm going to go through it. I have an iPhone 7. So remember, the, the Mavic is actually for the iPhone 6. So there's, there's actually a little go around that you have to do for the iPhone 7. Now they give you this, this cable uh, that comes with the charger that plugs into your iPhone. Okay, what happens is when you start, when you connect, it'll give you a gimbal error. And I'm going to show you that right now. So I'm going to go ahead and power this on. Okay, and then I'm going to power on the Mavic. All right, and let it connect. It's going to do its thing. All right, now I'm going to, as you can see, the controller, um, it's going through its startup thing. It'll soon go into GPS mode and it'll say ready to go. Okay, GPS mode and it's going to be ready to go here in a minute so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to connect this i'm going to go ahead and connect to the uh, dji app okay so we're going to launch the dji app and you see we have no connectivity all right so we're going to connect let's see if i can do this we're going to go ahead and connect to All right, and you will see here in a second that um, it's going to come on. All right, so we're good. All right, we have camera, we have everything. So everything's, we're connected, okay? And, well, you can't really see. But what will happen is when you're flying, this will cut out on you, okay? And it'll say um, error. In fact, it might do it here in just a minute. I don't know. Anyway, if that should happen to you, what you need to do is you need to um, you need to disconnect the iPhone from the controller, okay? And you'll need to connect a USB down on the bottom of the remote. There's a place to connect the USB connector, okay? And then you're going to plug that into the phone. But before you do that, you want to make sure that this cable is completely disconnected. Because if you don't, then it won't recognize it. It won't recognize your phone. It won't recognize anything. Now, you're ready to plug in to the USB. And you will have happy connectivity and you're ready to go and now you hear the Mavic fan come on it's ready to go all right um, and it'll stay it'll stay perfect uh, you it, it shouldn't cut out on you guys have been having this issue I bought this drone a few days ago I've been playing with it, um, it, it like I said I, it'll connect and I'll get up and I'll do some flying around and then it'll just disconnect on me by doing this, I have done this, I've, I've looked, I've researched. By doing this, I have done several flights now and it hasn't cut out on me at all. It stays connected and the Mavic is ready to go and you should have a happy life. So that is the solve, the solution. But remember, you can't leave this plugged in. You have to disconnect it. Otherwise, it won't because it, it's looking for one signal or the other. It won't recognize both and it recognizes this one primarily. So don't know why it does that, but it seems to do that. So if you're having those connectivities, if you're and and what it'll do is it'll show the gimbal disconnected. But as you can see, my gimbal status is perfectly normal now and everything is good. Except for I got to calibrate my compass, but uh, that's because of where it's sitting. So that's it. That's all there is to it. That's the solve. That's the go around. That's the issue solved to the uh, gimbal cutting out on you, especially if you're in flight. Now, if you're in flight and it should happen to cut out on you, it's not that big of a deal because you still have manual control and you can still fly it. You won't be able to see what you're doing, but you'll still be able to fly it manually with the, with the joystick. 
and and it doesn't it doesn't disconnect the drone from the joystick all it does is it stops you from seeing your video and everything that's going on within the app so you don't want that happening you don't because if you're recording video and it cuts out you're going to lose your video so that is the the go around very very simple fix i i was racking my brains on this trying to figure it out and i I did some some research and looking around even on DJI's website they'll tell you if that's happening to do this this is an issue correct so it's an issue that DJI is aware of they know about it it's probably going to be a firmware update or something or or maybe it'll be a different cable or something connectivity cable or something I don't know but they know about it and they tell you on their website to do this as a fix what they do not tell you is that if you do this as a fix you must disconnect this cable Otherwise, this won't work. So remember, disconnect that cable. That is your fix. Okay, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching the video.